Hey guys, it's Daniel Solid here, and uh, we just want to thank you for your generous gifts towards the uh, No Place Left Atlanta training fund. Over the last year, 2017, um, we've gotten to do some training in the U.S., mm -hmm. um, in Atlanta, and especially in Asia, mm -hmm. and we've seen about 8,500 people com uh, commit to follow Jesus wow. over the last year, and, and that's mostly in Southeast Asia. Um, about 870 new gatherings of those believers where they're being discipled, and about 10 new teams, um, some in Asia, but actually about four new teams in Atlanta. Wow. And about 10 new churches with a legacy in their community who are committed to uh, sending laborers and engaging the local area with disciple making. So mm. we just want to thank you for your giving. One of our goals for this year is to raise 30,000 um, towards training fund. Mm. And um, we've already raised 20,000. So this video is just sort of to say, hey, thank you. And if you're looking for a place to give this at the end of this year, uh, consider uh, reinvesting in the fund. Uh, this is Troy Cooper. He heads up strategy for North America under E3 Partners, which mm -hmm. is one of the organizations that is a part of a larger coalition that we call No Place Left. Mm -hmm. So, Troy, what are you seeing happen You know, outside Atlanta, outside of what our team's doing that you're excited about? Um, we're just part of something bigger, and I want mm -hmm. you to share some of that. Yeah, well, what's exciting is we're, we're seeing uh, God move in North America just like we're hearing stories of what he's doing over in Asia mm -hmm. and in different parts of the Middle East and in South America. But we're beginning to see uh, more and more people hear the gospel, more and more people come to Christ, more and more gatherings of churches that are starting and, mm -hmm. and even seeing some of those begin to be mobilized overseas. Yeah. And uh, we're seeing entire city coalitions form. Uh, I believe that uh, there's 40 of the top populated 50 cities in North America have active teams or coalitions that are making disciples and starting churches. Um, one of the things that we're really beginning to see develop is a vision for uh, teams that are forming that are growing into coalitions mm -hmm. in a city of churches and, mm -hmm. and teams and even organizations that are really wanting to see the gospel reach that entire city. Mm -hmm. And those coalitions growing into what we're calling hubs where they're seeing movement in the city, they're able to receive uh, families uh, or individuals who want to come and be trained to serve as, as catalytic missionaries, and they're being sent out of these hubs mm -hmm. uh, overseas. Mm -hmm. And I know you and, and some others have been working hard to help establish uh, the field hubs that are over in Asia, mm -hmm. uh, specifically in South Asia, where we're able to see movement here. Uh, people learn uh, the, the we, we see that their character um, has been confirmed and developed. Uh, the calling has been confirmed, but they're developing the competency mm -hmm. to make disciples and plant churches right. here in the U.S. And then they're being sent right onto the field. Right. And, um, and when you get to interact with, with nationals who also have a vision to plant right. churches, it's just a different dynamic when you've been doing the same thing in your own home hub. That's right. There's a, there's a new level of engagement we're able to have with national partners. And I know that's a lot of the fruit we've seen in Asia this year mm. has come through you know, some guys from America on our team going and pairing up with guys mm -hmm. in Asia and then co-laboring together to form mm -hmm. the same the same type of teams that you're seeing form all over North America right. are being formed in Asia. And so we're we've got the opportunity through this funding mm -hmm. to connect those two so that both of them can grow mm -hmm. in their um, capability to multiply and and mm -hmm. the, the funding has really been key for the for the training because there's travel costs mm -hmm. and we've been matching um, we've been matching all the funds pretty heavily. So folks who are, are bivocational, meaning they have a job here in Atlanta, they, they'll cover half of the funding. So any funding you give, you know, it gets doubled in terms of value in wow. that form. And then E3 Partners has been generous in terms of matching um, at the country fund level with mm -hmm. funds. Any funds that go in from this fund are also matched wow. through that, if we're, especially if we're using it to, to, to send Great national partners and tra as trainers. So, Well, I know... Uh, with the establishment of these hubs in the U.S. and over in Asia, uh, the, the Atlanta uh, team has been especially helpful. Uh, Daniel Yu and the team of, of being able to train and help establish teams and hubs in other cities. Mm -hmm. A lot of the work that you're leading uh, over in Asia has been instrumental. So um, this, this fund, this account that you're giving to is going to phenomenal use uh, to see the kingdom impact among these unreached, unengaged people groups all over the world and here in the States. So thank you. Thanks, Troy. Mm -hmm. And thank you all. Have a happy new year and uh, look forward to seeing some of you guys soon.